you guys remember who Bad News Bear was in WWE. He would come out and say, I'm afraid I got some bad news. And I know I botched it a little bit, but here is the official entrance for AEW's Kenny Omega and Adam Cole in AEW Fight Forever. Now, one thing that is very noticeable in this clip is that it's not the full blown entrance and it was confirmed that that is intentionally what they're going for so yes you can customize the entrance you can add to the entrance but it will not be a full blown entrance i repeat it will not be a full blown entrance so once you select the characters this is how they'll look you hit fight and you load into a match and it's just going to be an animation cutscene where it shows you a piece of it and it transitions into the next character and then the match begins. So that is as official as uh, official can be. We were all hoping for full entrances. Obviously, we're not getting it now. And I'm not totally sour. Lex, why are you not mad? Why are you not raging? Why are you not ranting? Well, because... Most of the time when you play online, people are skipping it or you just flat out don't use entrances. So when you play online, that's pretty much non-existent, even though they just added it to 2K22 again because everyone begged for it. It's just because it wasn't there that it, it started getting people to beg for it again. But ultimately, people still skip the shit out of it. So way back when I grew up playing on N64 those old school wrestling games and and th that's what kenny omega and everyone behind this game promised from the very beginning they promise a very nostalgic experience right and i feel like based on what we saw today the official raw gameplay the game has delivered on that promise and i'm excited for what's to come i want to see more I have a video where I just talked about all the new features confirmed. I will have it in the comment section for you guys to check that out. And um, you know what? No hard feelings. They don't have entrances here. We have 2K22 and then 2K23 whenever that drops with full entrances to enjoy. Um, we're, we're just going to have to see how much they allow us to customize each uh, you know, character entrance. So let's see how far we can push it. Once we start editing it ourselves in the customization features, which the THQ uh, developer said that we're going to be able to customize a lot of things and there's going to be a lot of creative freedom. So hopefully we could push it a little bit further than just a little animation we saw here. But even then, what I'm worried about is the gameplay. As long as the game doesn't feel stiff, um, I'm going to be excited and have a good old jolly time. I don't know why I said it like that, but guys. Hit me up in the comment section. How are you feeling, man? I think it looks awesome. It looks it, 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 it looks like it's going to be a fun time. That's all I keep saying in all my videos, and I'm going to continue to say that because I haven't played the game for myself, so I can't say the game looks garbage because this is exactly what they said in the very beginning when the game was announced. This is what they were going for, and it seems like they're going to deliver on that promise. So I'll see you on the next one. Thank you for tuning in. Subscribe for more wrestling. Peace out.